All right, tubes are gonna go follow Jimmy over here. Yeah. As I cut his head off, he's like. We had some uh, magical LED lights hanging around. Yeah, I had those left over from one of the trucks, I think. I don't remember which one, or one of the vehicles that had LEDs in them. Well, we're gonna see if they fit the Explorer's reverse lights. So if they should, if it does, it should be 11. I see they're, hopefully they're 1156, 1156s, because that's what those are. I think they, they were, because it's just one, one element. And then you're like, this is where we end up breaking that shit off. Oh, it's the uh, newer style. Yeah. Fiddlesticks. Oh, the tra oh, the trailer. <laughs> and it like doesn't even. He doesn't use. He doesn't even use that one no. circuit. I know. Let me. Uh, I want to see. See my if I, if I can't see, I put my my pods on. Yeah, but I don't remember. I think the last time that you did, they looked pretty halogen level. You sure those are LEDs? Oh yeah, those are. They should be. I don't think they are. They don't look like not. LEDs to me. Now they I are. I, I thought I put LEDs in there. Nope, now they are. Go get them, put them in there. I think I put LEDs in there. Cause I was like, man, that was nice and bright. Oh, maybe it was you that put LEDs in and then I'm thinking of that. Oh yeah, shit, cause, I need a beer. Yeah, cause they were bright as hell. No, I'm like, those look halogen. All right, so I was wrong. Ha, I knew they were crap. <laughs> we'll just leave them on so they're nice and hot when I go to... Like, hang on, what is he doing? He's installing stuff. Last time these were out was in Idaho. No. Aha! Uh -huh. There you go. Now it's gonna be brightest. If I need to see for real skis, I've I've got my backup pods. So. Okay. But yeah, I was like free upgrade. See, yeah. this is. These have been in there for a long time. I remember when we took my lights out; they were coming out of the sockets. Yeah. That was so stupid. That's how these used to be. And so now we're putting ricer lights. Oh, did you get it? Get her hooked up. Yeah, it's already hooked up. Nice. Shoved it in the, wedged it in between the pins and then shoved the light, old light bulb in there and that pin the wires on there. And there you go. We've got some pimp lights. Oh, wait, I should turn this off so you guys can see it. Those look cool on camera though. Kind of set it up so the backs look at too. Oh yeah, I want to get LED from the top. So I want, yeah, it's just just I want truck, light. You, when I turned that on, it was just like, you're like, you can see everything. I'm like, oh, I can eat off the floor. <laughs> well, uh, you know. You don't make it That's not working. Okay, let's turn that this way then. <laughs> and then it's like, it's just dead all together. It wasn't working at it. Now I'm like, well, what the fuck's going on? So your uh, column plastic stuff is the same as like for an Explorer. I don't jump that in. And like an OBS Ford. So you know what that means. They sell the, the top piece that has a spot for a gauge. <gasps> oh, we are so doing that. That, <laughs> <laughs> that idea's gone wrong. You're like, I would, wouldn't that be perfect for a boost gauge? We, we, we kind of turned the camera off to just tinker with things and think about things. So now it's the next day. Whoa. So he's still got to do the, these outer inner lights, but but there. But he's got he's got four out of the six with LED, LED here, LED LED there. LED, uh, have you done the reverse lights yet? No, uh, those, no. Are, those are those are regular. Okay. Those are regular stuff. LED dimming hickeys there. LED there. Go ahead and put your brakes on. Yeah. All right. It's a ka-chink, ka-chink, ka-chink. We gotta get a different uh, clicker in it. No, you can't. It's embedded in the light control. So we have to do the resistor thing then. I could, but it doesn't, it, it, if, if you hear it, it's not too terrible. 
I know, but then a cop's gonna like something's wrong with your turn signals. And then, and then, uh, well, why do you, why did you lock it? Never mind his socks, but, uh, yeah, uh huh. This stayed there, no problem. Hit no problem. This one's being a bitch. <laughs> what the hell? I might have to re-clean this, it. And I didn't you know clean what? The surface. You know what, guys? Don't don't worry about that. Don't worry about that right now. That's that's, that's temporary. The, things are happening there. That's temporary. Um, and then we went around and you know we thought we'd Christmas it up. Yeah, there are green LEDs all over the place. Yeah. You know why not? Who cares? But yeah, and he's got most of the lights up front are LED now. You just have the turn signals up front that need to go LED. And then these amber corner lights that don't work because they're burnt out. Yeah. LED headlights. Is it turned on? Yeah, and then we got put an LED courtesy light on. Or in. Yeah, that. Jazzing it up. What? There's not much left that needs to be converted. Yeah, we did quite a bit of it just in a day. All I got left is, <laughs> see, four back here, and then two up front, I think. Yeah. And then LED everywhere. They got, you got the, the 88 gasket. Got some gear lube. You got some uh, 900 weight. 80-90. I know. God, God. Yeah, oh. son of a... You sons of a bitch. Oh, check this out, guys. Adam Adam hooked this up. Look at that. We needed this. Uh, well, I was like, I was tired of screwing around with it, and they were just going to scrap it, so I was like, better right, let's take it. Yeah, that's that's nice. You know, like, the bench is getting cluttered again. The product that's going to be. And then they used gear lube. We can filter it, kind of. Uh, it's, kind of it's probably going to be like an explorer. You're you know, no, we're going to dump that right now. So in the I bucket. bought this just in case. Yeah. Because we. I haven't physically looked at it. If the clutches are so worn out, that would explain why it's acting like an open. Yeah, and if it is an open, then we don't need that. Yeah, and I can just return it or we keep it stuck. Like you could return it, but I have a feeling we're going to end up <coughs> needing it later down the road. Oh, yeah, that's true. Well, we can just keep it. <laughs> yeah. That, you know, you could just stash it right there. Yeah, there there we go. That's. I mean, it's not a permanent home, but it'll, it'll go there. We won't forget about oh, it. God, why? Oh, God! Oh, God! What? How do you fill these up? And it's got a felt plug on the other side. Oh shit. If you could just slide over, I can put this under you. God damn it. That ball's moving. Yeah. Oh hell. No. <laughs> I'm trying to do this while looking through the viewfinder. Oh damn it. <laughs> 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 Since you're working out very well. <laughs> Instead of just jabbing you. Stab me. Stab me like one of your French girls. <laughs> ah. Okay, Why there. are you putting that in here again? So me and Jimmy are getting this loose. We decided we need to bring it up more because it wasn't enough space to actually get at everything. And I was crammed in here and we couldn't break them loose all the way. Yeah, I gotta get it a little more open. We got the impact in here for some of these, but... We mentioned it smells awful. Yeah, it's in a longer bolt than the rest of them. I remember when Jimmy had to do the front dip on the, his old 95 and I had to finish it because it was so bad he was about hurled. Oh my god. That stuff stink. This stinks too. It's awful. Okay, do you think it's going to be black? I think it's going to be pretty nasty. It smells nasty. Are you ready? Hold on, let me move the camera back just a little bit. Alright, go. Oh, that sounded gnarly. I found out there's no oil in here. Oh, that looks halfway decent. Oh, it smells gorgeous. Oh, no, it's dirty. Look at uh, that. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of red. Okay. I think the Explorer was worse, but this definitely needs to be changed out. And then the wind starts blowing. Uh, and it's all over your face. 
like every time we did the oil on your truck. Oh god, yeah, that was bad. Let's play What Are You? Well, yeah, let's just open Dickerential. Let me get a flashlight. Take a look at the... Spider gears. <clears throat> look good. <laughs> your arms in the way. <laughs> Todd's like, damn it. They look, they look really good, actually. There's hardly anywhere. They're just... The uh, hardening coating uh, is just wore off, and now uh, you can see machined. Not really machined, but gives me, you know, this feels nice, not razor sharp. Got a healthy rear end there. Ah. Oh. No chunks of metal. Ah, ah. Ah, that's. A, there is a lot of goop in there, isn't there? Yeah, it's uh, there's still a little bit from the pinion bearing that's running out. And... So this is the 88 gaskette. We're gonna just clean that up real good, clean the pumpkin, and then uh, slap it back on, and hopefully we can get that fill plug on it. We probably should have done that first. Wouldn't that be awful? Well, you know what we're doing if we could, if that wouldn't have work. Oh Jesus. We're uh, we're putting a, dr a fill plug in the cover. You know, I don't know why they don't do that. Like, come on, put a fill plug. It'd be so much easier to maintain, but they don't want you to do that because they want you to buy a new vehicle. They want you to, they want you to maintain it at the dealer. Yeah, fuckers. <laughs> no, we're not gonna take it. <laughs> no, 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 no. Do you want a razor blade for the RTV? Try to get. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, Tubes, we uh, got the differential filled up with... <laughs> <laughs> we kind of stopped recording it some way. It's the same thing I did with the Explorer. We just clean everything up, put the diff back on, and we, we got three the... bottles in, and I was going into a little bit of the fourth bottle. Next thing we know, Tubes is like, what's that sound? Yeah, we spilled your love. But basically, if anybody's watched my differential video on that, I filled it up. We've, we did the same fill up procedure. Input eight. Yeah. Well, I have this little hose that I ran to the differential under the frame, over the exhaust, and into the diff. And uh, we put the gear oil in a thing of hot water to kind of, you know, loosen it up a little oh bit. Oh god, that was painful. God. But it worked better than it being cold, though. Yeah, and also repositioning the hose because I didn't know how you used it. Yeah. Now you got it. Once you get it past the frame, it's got to go over something to get some momentum, and then down into the diff. I think I think this means we're gonna have to maybe do something with that cart where we have a like a little pump on it where it'll suck fluid from a clean container and then force it into what we're trying to fill up. So that yeah. would be amazing. So we're just spraying this down with some simple grin. If that doesn't work, I'll get purple power or crud and, cutter and, and spray that. I have some crud cutter that I could soak that with, there you and go. Now I can soak. and then I'll get the pressure washer and pressure wash it. I'm gonna buy some more RAM board so we can put that down so we have another spill. The RAM board will yeah, soak it up. Yeah, it went right over the board. Of, oops. Yeah, and I, you know what? I was thinking about it. I was like, we should put the tub under it. That's usually what I do. I put the tub under it. And once it overfills, it goes into the tub. And, and of course, uh, I didn't do that. I, yeah, for, I forget it, but whatever. We have the means to clean some shit up, so. But yeah, I think that might be it. Hey, now that it's getting darker out, put put that away. Let's, tr let's check out the lights again. and. Oh yeah, that's right. It's getting darker out. We're this is gonna be the the pimp mobile, pimping it out. Cool. Well, I think that's enough of that. Send it. Send it. Send it.